Hey everybody, it's Icy back, and today, in this episode, we are going to <laughs> hopefully explore Telenor Cave. And, in the meantime, we picked up a new team member. Yes, we picked up a Bayleaf, and I'm very happy about that. <clears throat> so let's see, it has a... Let's see, its special defense is raised, and speed is lowered. Okay. Oh, wait. Okay, so special defense is raised, but attack is lowered, and... Oh! Well, okay, that's kind of bad for, uh, for Flaffy. Its speed is lowered, but a special attack is raised. So, I mean, that's kind of good, I guess. And Frost is... And Frost really isn't the, uh, the fastest of electric types. I was really kind of hoping that it would, like, lower attack and give it more speed, but uh, can't have everything, so, um, and, uh, never, never got any repels, so, what the, run into a bunch of wild Pokemon, which is always fun, it's always fun, like this, now, what is it gonna give us? Oh, Miss Magius, awesome, okay, uh, okay, so, and we really need to get Flaffy some new moves. Cause uh, Thunderbolt or Thundershock is not gonna cut it. I can't. I don't know what level Flaffy learns Thunderbolt. Which uh, I'm so glad that the uh, special attack is raised because if you all know, Ampharos is a very high special has a very high special attack stat, and since it's the nature it has raises it, that's good for me. And, uh... Oh, you reduced the Thundershock by four, you dick. And that's really the only thing that I couldn't hit with Tackle. I mean, I wouldn't hit anything with Tackle, because Tackle sucks. Um, but I'm hoping, hoping that the Ampharosite is in this game. I would like to get a Mega Ampharos. Cotton Spore, already? Yes, make a move for Cotton Spore, are you kidding? Replace... Replace Growl. That's good for Flaffy. Want to have Cotton Spore? That raises defense. What, is it sharply or is it drastically that it raises it? It... Wait, what? Okay, I don't... Okay, the EVs and IVs, I, I don't understand at all. I don't, I don't, I don't, don't get the IVs and the EVs. Okay, the, red, cotton spore. That cling to the target, harshly reducing its speed. But, it does... Wait, doesn't Cotton Spore raise his defense? I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure Cotton Spore raises defense, but it does decrease. It's what is tre Oh, it's a Delta Full Trevenant. Oh, that is awesome looking. That's like a cherry blossom tree. Oh, that's cool. But uh, we don't need it. Fairy wind. So it's a fairy type now instead of a ghost in grass. Is it a ghost? Is the ghost and fairy type? All right, we're gonna hit this thing with a flamethrower. So it's yeah, it's so it's ghost and fairy. Then that's not ghost and it's not fairy and grass. Huh. Guys, I need to check something real quick. Okay, and we're back. <coughs> Excuse me, we're back. 
Let's see here. Oh, pincer. That's, uh, if I was a fan of bug types, I would use it. <laughs> but, uh, fortunately, I'm not a fan of bug types, so we're not going to use it. So, uh, this trainer, I swear, like, the trainers can literally have anything on them. I gotta shut that. Okay, so I had to shut my vent because it's blowing hot air into my room. And you're probably thinking, well, it's, it's winter time. You need to stay, you need to stay warm. <laughs> Very hot in nature. Can't stay in the heat. Okay, let's see what this guy has. Aren't you a little bit young? Eh, young to be traveling with Pokemon. I am 19. Why don't people get this about me? Alright, let's see what he has. Axew? He has a dragon type? Jeez. Okay, so... Okay, we're gonna test this out. Cotton Spore. Oh! What was that move that increases? De the defense was a pretty sure like was it like cotton shield or something like that <sighs> come on X you you're gonna go down oh come on oh Flappy don't go down no 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 oh Well, I'm glad that uh, Flaffy doesn't evolve with happiness or freaking uh, friendship. Because it would never evolve into an Ampharos then. I just gotta get it. I just gotta get it up to level 36. And then we get our team's mascot. Axio. Let's see. I, did, forgot, I forgot what he said he had. Sigleth. It's a. Is that a ghost and flying type? I want to say it's ghost and flying. Aw, oh, you dick. <laughs> so, the cool thing about this game is that you can make your own moves. Or you can make a move. I'm going to... Uh, oh my god, Ninetales, wake up, thank you. Jesus. Um... I'm gonna try to make a move for Ampharos that try to make a move for Ampharos that increases its special attack, if that's even possible, which I hope it is, because Ampharos, while it is, while it is a very high special attacker, it, I feel like it would actually benefit from a special attack that booster, or even a move that increases speed very very drastically because trust me it even though it may be my favorite Pokemon I will be the first to admit that it is pretty slow and it's mega it really doesn't complement that I'll even put on the screen its stats like because its stats really don't complement its speed it's very good in, uh, special attack but that's really all it's got good going for it in terms of like attacking wise because I'm pretty sure it's attack is it's attack is not bad but uh, why would you use like a thunder punch on an Ampharos rather than you can use thunder you know what I mean and but but it needs something to increase its speed and so if it has I'm, I don't I'm trying to think is there a oh my god a wall rain uh, we need a water type. This would be a good thing to have, though. This would be a good thing to have. Plus, I could... You know what? For right now, we'll get a wall rain. We'll get a wall rain. Just, just to have a water type. And plus, we get an ice type very early on. Come on, just keep quick attacking it. Alright, one more quick attack should be good. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> okay, no, one, 
Okay, I want to get into the red health. Oh, jeez. Okay, it missed. That's good. Water gun. Ooh, it has water gun already. Damn. Alright, we're going to use Pokeball. Okay. Come on. Come on, give me this. Give me this wall rain. Come on. One, two, three. Ah. Oh, dang it. Another roll out. Oh my god. Nine tails. Or wall rain. You need to get inside the ball now. Two, three. Oh, come on. Ugh. Okay, we're going to have to heal because actually because that rollout's just going to get stronger. We can't afford to lose nine tails cuz all we have all we would have is a level 3 bay leaf and it's completely it's completely useless cuz it's level 3 and it's paralyzed. So we will have no use for it. None at all. So I'm trying to get the buttons right. I'm not using a controller, I'm using a keyboard. I'm using my keyboard. <laughs> See, and that's the thing though, I need to train up Bayleaf. Because it is. Because I like uh, Meganium. Meganium is one of my favorite grass types. Uh, ooh. Toby, you're so slow. That took you forever. Anyways, I think that's the rare stone Mayor was talking about. Over there on the far right of the cave, you can't miss it. He will not leave Tillinor Town alive. Uh oh. So let me guess. Gradon and Kyogre. My agent is already in place. I assume yours is too? Yes. An arm to the brink with the strongest of Pokemon. Rest assured, he will be dead before he leaves Tillinor Town. Jeez. Very good. The Augur disgusts me. I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Oh, okay. That would disgust me. I could at least grudgingly respect the first one, but this one's just useless. He's practically brainwashed the entire region with all this propaganda he spread about himself. Have you heard about this ridiculous some sort he is? What? He was born on he was born of fire and lightning, and he rode Xeranids as a steed. The man's been Augur for a year, and already the people are worshipping him. Well, we won't have to worry about him after today, do we? Let's get going. So, are the Groudon and Kyogre, or Kyogre cults working together? Toby, those were cultists, really. I never would have guessed that. You know what they were saying? They're planning to assassinate the Augur when he comes to Telenor Town. I can't believe we caught, <laughs> caught up in the middle of this. We need to get help. We need to get back and warn the Augur before the assassins get to him. We have to hurry. The Augur might have already arrived. Quick, let's go. Well, at least we don't have to go back through the cave. Damien, Toby, you're late. The auger arrived five minutes ago. He's waiting for you in the town hall. Oh, we have to hurry. The auger should be attacked any minute. Now. Okay. Is this... Is this town hall? Yes. Yes. Hello. I... We need to give this guy, like, a really stuck-up voice. Oh, hello. I am Jaren, the second auger. It's nice to meet you all. You have a very lovely town. What might be your name, young one? <laughs> I say stuck up, but it's like he, like he was overly British. Um, my name's Damien, and this is Toby. Big fan, sir. We're here to warn you that one of the co one of the guests here wants to kill you. <laughs> That's a very serious accusation, Damon. I'm so sorry about this, sir. Damien, what are you saying? You're embarrassing us. You'll be punished for this. Well, jeez. Actually, I wouldn't worry about it. He'll get enough punishment here as it is. Uh-oh. Here we go. 
And wait, is that they? Okay. And who might you be? We're cultists. I knew it. And we're here to kill you. What? No, you can't. In fact, <laughs> you won't even get a chance to battle him. I'll stop you two right now. Come on, Toby. Kid, you've been watching way too many superhero movies. That I have. Or cultists. We have strong Pokemon and actual weaponry. You have actual weapons? Jeez! Alright then, kid. Just don't say we didn't warn you. And it looks like you're mine. Feel the wrath of my... The Abyssal Cult? Okay, so Kyogre. But there was a Groudon cultist too. Okay, so it's all electro. I was gonna say it's all randomized, so I don't know what this guy has. And thank god that So it healed Wait, it didn't heal me. You're you're freaking crazy. This Uh This it always heals when you have to do something like this. It always heals you. I'm pretty sure. Oh my god, it's so slow. Barbarical. That's a... What's well, a rock and ground type? Or a rock, ground and water type? Does does Bayleaf have any grass moves? Let's just see. Because I don't know if it does. It has Razor Leaf, but there's no way in hell <laughs> that it's staying out. Uh, god, this is going to be bad for Ninetales. Ninetales really isn't the best Pokemon to be doing this. I don't know how Nine. I don't know how well Ninetales slash. Oh, jeez. I don't. I don't know how well Ninetales is gonna be gonna go up against this thing. That was a critical. Jeez. Water gun. Oh no. Oh my God. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> if if oh god, it was a critical hit. <laughs> Jesus. Oh no. Oh. What are we? Four episodes in, and I lost twice. Fury swipes. Yep. Sorry, Bayleaf. Yep. If it would only hit one time, it would be fine. Well, I guess they get to kill the auger now. They're just gonna wait. <laughs> okay, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna train all my Pokemon. Okay, th this is the end of the episode. Wait. Okay, it wasn't there. Ugh. It doesn't like me. Anyway, I'm gonna save here. And so, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to cut the video here. This is gonna be the episode. And I'm gonna come back with all my Pokemon at like level 15. That way, you can actually, that way, Bayleaf can actually stand a chance of that barbarical. But, anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to give the video a like, comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next time. See you later.